Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Bookcraft, the world where my friends and I build things from my favorite books and my own imagination. Let's get back into the story. In the last episode, we worked on our build for the twilight barking over all of dogdom. I have a heart and a half. Typical Stacey. I don't know why. I don't know why I only have a heart and a half. Uh, and I only have one stew and three. Okay, I'm going to need to go get some stew from Olive. Uh, but in this episode, we're going to continue to build things out of the 101 Dalmatians. I've got a few more projects to work on uh, past the twilight barking. Uh, Nathan. Hello. Hello. How are you? Doing swell. Are you? Uh, I'm good. Uh, I have something I want to do, though. Uh, come with me. I want to grab... Actually, do I have some more bowls in here? I have one more bowl. And I meant to grab up here my fishing rod. Do I? Oh, mm. here it is. And this cooked salmon. And we'll bring a water bucket because, you know, you never know. And anything else I need? Oh, a bucket of milk, obviously. And I think that, that should be good. All right, Nathan. Uh, I need to go and... Uh, say hi to Ms. Reads a lot, like I always do. Hi, Ms. Reads a lot. And grab some stew from Olive. But then I want to do something that a lot of people have been telling me to do, which is to check Dog Ear's diary because he oh. has been missing uh, for so long. Okay, there. I'm full now, and I have stew. I have a few stew. Uh, all right, so let's go look. I feel like I'm a little bit, you know, invading his, his personal space. Yeah. But he's missing, and this has to be done. Dog Ears Diary. I got it. Dear Diary, my name is Dog Ear. Not sure what else to say. I am more of a reader than a writer. I like sausages. Dog Ear. Okay. Oh, huh. there's five pages. Dear Diary, life at the station is quite eventful. So far, my owner has put me in peril several times. Whoops. <laughs> Let's see, there was the volcano, the roller coaster with the loop de loop, and let's not forget about the plane crash. Well, when mm. he puts it that way, I guess he does have sort of a, a high risk life here at the station. He really does. Luckily, the kind librarian gives me all the sausages I can eat. I love her. Is he talking about Ms. Reed's a lot? He can't be. What? Anyway, I wonder what the next book will be, Dog Ear. Okay, let's see what else. Dear Diary, the next book is The 101 Dalmatians by Dodie Smith. Strange things happen in the world of bookcraft when Stacy starts a book. <gasps> I have had a Cruella sighting already. I am going to the nether to follow her awful scent. Dog ear! Oh, oh my. my gosh! Oh wait, there's another page. Ode to Sausage by Dog Ear. Spicy, it's a haiku! Spicy and tasty. Delicious, plain, or with milk. I'm sorry, Wilbur. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a good haiku, dog here. Uh, all right. Well, um, Nathan, this is a... Uh, has there always been a, a pillar of trapdoors here? I feel like I've never noticed that before. Hmm. Every time I walk by, I'm just going to want to do this. <laughs> uh, okay, there I need can, to grab man. some cobblestone for what we're going to be working on today. But there is something. The nether. He went to the nether. That's that's not good, Nathan. It's really not. Um, I need to... Oh, my inventory's already full. I don't want to put this stuff in here because it's not it's not meant to go in here. But I need all of this stone for what we're working on today. Uh, all right, Nathan, actually, I want to go to the nether and I want to show you something uh, about the biome in the nether uh, in regards mm -hmm. to Cruella de Vil, actually. Uh, however, uh. I guess it doesn't hurt to, like, call dog ear a few times. Uh, to the nether? Absolutely. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, dear. Nathan? <laughs> What's happening? What is going on? <laughs> Nathan. Yes. There's too many pigmen in here. I I actually cannot hear you over them right now. There's too many pigmen in here. What's that? I can't hear you over the pigmen. 
There's too many pigmen. I can't even open the door. There we go. Oh, some babies ran out. Uh, Nathan? Yes? I have my hatchet texture pack on. You know? <laughs> As do I. The one where we made sand. Netherrack look like sand. Yeah. <laughs> so that we could make a fire at the beach. <laughs> this looks so weird. Yes, it's amazing. Oh my gosh. Okay, look for dog ear, but don't go too far. Dog ear! Dog ear? Dog ear. Maybe he's up here. Uh, he's Hello? not over here. So what I wanted to talk to you about was that the actual biome here, uh, if I go into my coordinates, I'm not going to say the word because some people don't like it, but if you look right there where it says biome, it says H-E-L-L. -L. And actually, the house in the 101 Dalmatians by Dodie Smith, uh, the house, so Cruella has her own house, but then she buys, or I guess she has this other family home where she hides all of the Dalmatians, and it's called H-E-L-L -L Hall. But originally, uh, before her family owned it, before the DeVilles owned it, uh, it was called Hill Hall. So I think for the purposes of this series, uh, we will call it Hill Hall, just to not, you know, annoy anyone. <coughs> My mother. <laughs> what do you say, Nathan? I think that's a grand idea. But that's what I wanted to work on today. Um, <laughs> this sandy nether is, is pretty funny. Uh, all right, I guess we should go back to the overworld. I have no idea. Dog Ear could have gone anywhere in here. And yeah. this is actually quite terrifying. <laughs> what I'm scared about is what if Corilla had her own portal somewhere? I don't know. All right, let's go back and, oh, oh gosh. Let's maybe open this door. Come on, guys, you're free. You're, <laughs> you're free. Come on, guys. All right, Nathan, just don't hit them, please. Please, please don't hit them. I'm uh, tempted to. What do you mean you're tempted to? Do you know how quickly I would die? Yes, I do. That's not nice, Nathan. All right, <laughs> let's go back uh, to the overworld. All right. Oh, um. goodness. Oh, bother. Uh, all right, Nathan, let's go ahead and take the train uh, out to... Uh, wait, where? I missed it. To the 101 Dalmatians. Uh, let's go. You know, I wonder, can I look, can I do the word of the episode while I'm on the train? I can! This Aww. is so exciting! So today is word of the episode. Nathan, by the way, happy 50th episode of Bookcraft. I can't believe that we've done 50 episodes, uh, many of them with you flying by my side, but I digress. Back to the word of the episode. So today's word of the episode is going to be folly. And folly is what we are going, wait, I've stopped. Did you oh, no. stop me? No. Why have I stopped? I do not know. Oh, there was another um, another mine cart uh, on the tracks. All right, we're going good. Oh, I got to get some speed. Oh, I'm kind of stuck here. I don't think that the train liked me reading a book. Uh, Nathan? Yeah? Something bad happened. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I fell. <laughs> Okay, uh, I'm gonna go and take the ladder uh, over by the 101 Dalmatians uh, house. But anyway, Nathan, it's the 50th episode of Bookcraft. Isn't that I amazing? Know. It's it's so crazy. So today's word is going to be folly, and a folly is actually an ornamental building with no practical purpose, uh, kind of like a tower. And today, we are actually going to be building the folly, and this is from uh, the chapter, What They Saw From the Folly in the 101 Dalmatians. Uh, Nathan, quickly, uh, to, to the sheep pen, quickly, quickly. Oh, oh. We must okay. sleep. Uh, because I don't want to build during the day. Oh, actually, though, you know what? No, it doesn't matter. Because as soon as I go over the twilight barking section of uh, the railway, it's going to reset it to twilight anyway. 
Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. I'm excited because I only wrote it the one time in the last episode. We should probably add a detector rail though, Nathan, so that after you've gone through it, you hit a detector rail and it turns it back to daytime. Um, yeah, probably. That would, that would be nice. Uh, oh, look, there's already a minecart here for me. Let's go. <sighs> All right. So in the last episode, if you didn't see it, we built the Twilight Barking, or well, I should say P-Dog and Jess Panda and Nathan built the Twilight Barking all of, uh, over all of Dogdom. Wait, have I hit the rail? Ooh, ooh, here we go! Oh, the lights are turning on one um, by Stacey? one! Yes, Nathan? Stacey. Oh, right, the track. Um, oh! Ah! Oh! <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. I totally forgot. So we should probably extend the track at some point. Uh, over. Yeah. Oh, look at the world from this angle. This is so cool. Uh, so I think we want to... Let me get my sword out, actually. I want to build Cruella's Hill Hall uh, over in this swamp, uh, which is perfect because, mm -hmm. you know, the, the track is leading here anyway. Uh, it's rather dark, though. Oh, we've got some pigs and some rabbits. Uh, so we just need to scout a location. Actually, I think... I did scout a location, and I put down some inspiration materials for the house. I just don't remember exactly where that was here in the swamp, and I don't want to see... Unfortunately, the color of the grass in this swamp is basically the exact color of creepers. So, do I have oh, torches? Yeah. I have two torches uh, and no coal. So, if I can get... Oh, there's some coal right here, though. Maybe I might actually mine this coal really quick if I don't get blown up. Uh, can I throw something out? Anything? Uh, half slab. Goodbye, half slab. All right. I think this will actually be the perfect place to build Hill Hall because it's kind of like, uh, you know, it's darker and we can have the vines and I think it'll look really cool. Uh, have you found yeah. my? Have you found my inspiration materials yet? I have. You have. Yes. All right, perfect. Am I close? Uh, oh, skeletons. Oh, you can see Mesa from over here. Oh, I can see you. Your head just like popped out. Yeah, oh, turn to your yeah. left. Yeah, kind of fighting. Turn to the left. Oh, hi, Nathan. Is this it oh. over here? Yeah. Perfect. Hello, mean skeleton. Hello. Uh, so we have a lot of work to do, actually, because we're probably not even going to get to Hill Hall in this episode because we're going to build the Folly which is the the tower, and then there's a giant wall connected to the folly that goes in the entire perimeter of the house. Ooh, the zombie went on top of the tree. There we go. So this is the cracked stone. I like it. And look mm -hmm. at this cool, I think this is the black stained glass. Yeah. Um, what is this here? Is this bedrock? That is bedrock, yes. Bedrock, interesting. And then that's just black wool, and mm -hmm. then that's... Are those both pistons or? Yeah, just facing different ways. Oh, so you can have that like with the X and then you could also have the like swirliness. Oh, and I suppose you could also use an iron door. Is that the, is that, that that's this dark color as well, isn't it? It is, yeah. Here, let me put it down. <gasps> Ooh, that. Ah! Oh. Where's, oh, a slime. Look at the slime. Have we seen slime in this texture pack before? I don't think so. I feel like this is a first for Bookcraft. I could be I wrong. I was on fleek slime. This is cool looking. Hello, slimy. Oh, Nathan. Oh, wait there. Yeah, it's hitting me. I was going to say I didn't think oh. it was hitting me. I thought we could be friends, slime. I thought we could be best friends. Love me. Well, you're not wrong. Love me, slime. Oh, look at the mesa. Oh, is that a skeleton? Uh, sword? Okay, he's not coming after me, but I will kill him anyway. Mm. Um, all right, Nathan. Why don't we get another? <laughs> I'm gonna die. 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 Stacy. Yeah. You're okay. You're okay. It's okay. fine. No, I mean, I have two hearts. Oh. Yeah, you're gonna die. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Where'd that spider go? All right. Do I have any arrows? I think I do. All right. Uh, don't save me, Nathan. I can save myself. 
Oh, one shot. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, okay. Um, anyway, let me just regen a little bit. But anyway, I was thinking, what could we do that would be super exciting for the 50th episode of, of Bookcraft? <gasps> do not hit me! <laughs> Nathan! You know I'm regening. Anyway, so it occurred to me, why it's not you. get another pet? Whoa! Whoa! Creeper. Why is that zombie moving? I think I'm lagging. I think I'm lagging. Nathan, I'm pretty confident that I'm lagging. You're not. You're not. I was. I, the zombie moved really, really fast. Um, all right. Anyway, I, look, what I'm trying to say is I'm going to get a cat, Nathan. That's what uh, I'm trying to say. From the book, The 101 Dalmatians. She is a tabby cat, and we won't get her in this episode. We will get her in the... Did you just put that block... <laughs> Nathan! <laughs> yes. Nice try. Anyway, as I was saying, we're not going to get her in this episode. <laughs> I know where a jungle is. We're going to go in the next episode, but I am going to start fishing so that I have lots of mm -hmm. fish so that I can tame the cat. Uh, but let's go ahead and get started on the folly and the wall. And so we will be right back. Good morning. Uh, I am back and I have been fishing up a storm. Uh, in order to get enough fish to tame Tib. Uh, I think in the movie, actually, he's known as Sergeant Tibbs. But in the book, I think it's a her name is Pussy Willow, but she goes by Tib. So I haven't quite decided what I'm going to name my cat yet. Uh, based on either the name of the book or... Can I fish from this far? I wanted to come up to this tree for to show you guys something else, but... I don't know if I can. Either the fish aren't biting, or you can't fish from this far away. Nathan, any thoughts? I think you shouldn't be fishing from the top of a tree. Why not? Seems rather dangerous. It's kind of fun. Look how far my line is. Uh, kind of building, Stacy. I just don't think it works. I really haven't caught anything here. Cotton? Did I say cotton? Yeah. No, I you didn't. did. Edit that out, Stacey. I'm not going to edit it out. I'm going to forget. <laughs> <sighs> anyway, so Nathan's cleared out a lot of land over here, and we've gone over what we think we want to uh, do. Nathan's working on... Oh, hi, sheepy! Uh, this is... So this is the start of the folly. So it's kind of my idea that, that when you first come over here in the train, the first thing you would be presented by would be the folly. And there will be like an entrance on this side, and then also like an entrance on... Because uh, the folly is like at the corner of... Uh, the walls. So there's going to be walls mm -hmm. keeping everything out on both sides, but like the folly is kind of a way to come through. Oh, hi, creeper. My goodness. Uh, let's kill you. Get away. Get away from me. Please get away. Oh, he's going to blow. Oh, hey, I think griefing is turned off. Yeah. Oh. We should probably turn that back on. <laughs> uh, oh, Endermen were messing with the toilet park. Oh, that's right. That's what it was. I think P-Dog was uh, about to kill some Endermen. Um, yeah. Anyway, so uh, the folly is kind of like the way in and out uh, of mm -hmm. the, the Hill House uh, gates. And then this little pillar that I did over here, that glass pillar up there represents, Nathan put that there to represent where the... Uh, the wall will extend to and then this pillar that I put right here represents kind of like where we think that the front of the uh, The house will be that I put over there, but it'll be kind of like here um, And then these blocks over here are kind of like where the wall is although this might go out farther now Nathan Do you I've got a bunch of I want to help like a little bit Because <laughs> I feel like mm -hmm. you do most of the heavy lifting in bookcraft um, but <laughs> Are you going to be using cobblestone, or should I make a furnace and smelt all of the... Oh, wait, I can't smelt... Yeah, smelt all of this and then make uh, stone brick. I'm going to be using mainly stone brick. Stone brick? Yeah. And can I... I don't think I've ever crafted moss stone brick. Have I? Do you use vines? I think you use vines, yeah. I don't even know this, and I didn't bring shears. With... Oh, no, I do. I have shears. Perfect. So I'm going to go ahead and make... Um, I should have grabbed some of the wood that you had, uh, when you're breaking all those trees. I'm going to mm -hmm. go ahead and make a furnace. Have I shown a picture yet of the folly? Let me go ahead and show a picture of what we're building so people know. Uh, there it is. Um, 
all right, I'm going to go ahead and make this furnace and get smelting. Uh, but then Nathan's gonna do most of it in creative mode and we'll be right back. The folly turned out better than I expected. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? I mean, it's a compliment. I'm sorry. Yeah. It looks awesome. <laughs> Look at Thank this. You. I really like this. Ooh, wait. Does this button do anything? Not yet, but I have plans. <gasps> what are the plans? Um, I'm thinking of putting like a piston extender underneath here. <gasps> so that when you press this button, like the door will open. You could probably do that off of a detector rail. Yeah, exactly. I could also make it uh, activate with a det detector rail, and so the train could, like, come in. That's so cool. And... Yeah. <laughs> Look at Mr. Slime in the tree. Hey, don't hit me. Why can't they be nice? They're so cool. Someday, Stacy. I just want them to be nice. Oh, uh, okay. I, I feel as though I'm lagging quite a bit. The slime has not hit the ground. It's just levitating in the air. <laughs> I don't know why I'm lagging so much lately. I think um, I think I'll just come back once we've actually built most of the wall. So we are back. I've left it raining. It's a little atmospheric. Oh my gosh, Nathan, come here. Yes. Oh, you can't see it anymore. There was something on the other. You could see it over the wall. Oh, there dear. is a giant slime in there. I saw it bouncing over the wall, Nathan. That can't be good. Okay, so this is the folly. Nathan, you built some dead trees. <laughs> yes. What? You did. You're, you're so enthusiastic about them, Stacy. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm a little bit more enthusiastic about what Jasper has been working on. So not only has he made it so that there's always bats here, which if you remember the picture of the folly, there are several bats hidden in the picture. Um, so now there's bats everywhere here. Uh, but he also made this really cool redstone entrance to the folly that he's going to show us right now. Right, Jasper? Okay. Whoa, look at that. And then there's the minecart. That's crazy. That's and it all like, it was kind of all invisible too. Like it just Magical. kind of appeared. So you can, we can <laughs> put grass blocks there then like blocking it up, right? Like that. <gasps> look at that. So the train track, wherever it comes from, will like bring you right into there. Die. Um, that's so cool. That'll be awesome. So it'll bring you right into the folly, which is super cool. I haven't had a chance to really check out yet, Nathan. Nice work. Oh, there's ba I love the bats, Jasper. That's such a nice touch. Hello, cute little bat. Look how cute you are. Look at your smiling. You're not supposed to be cute. You're supposed to be a mean, scary bat. <gasps> They're so adorable. I want one as a pet. Uh, good luck. I... I want one. I have one as a pet in a different series. Why can't I have one here? Mod Stacy. All right, I'm going to see the giant slime. <gasps> He's huge. Oh, Whoa. hi, skeleton. Now, wait a minute. That's a massive slime. Oh, gosh. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh. I did not see that coming. <laughs> Can you TP? Just TP me. Just TP me. Nathan, just TP me. Okay, okay, teleporting you. Oh my gosh. He's. Oh, oh, half hearts. Half hearts. <laughs> half hearts. Guys. Oh no. Get my stuff. Okay, Come I'm coming to get it. my stuff. I'm coming to get my stuff. I got it. Did I get it all? Oh, he hit me. I have half a heart. <laughs> get him away from me. <laughs> no. <laughs> TP me. TP me. TP me. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. I got it. I got it. Okay. Um, I'm cool. I got full hearts now. Um, I didn't want to, I didn't want to like kill him. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and... Uh, we're gonna build Cruella's house here, and it's yeah. gonna be epic, and it's gonna be cool, um, and I, I really, I want him to be nice, but he's not nice. Look at this. Oh my gosh. No! <laughs> I couldn't back up any farther. <laughs> TP me. TP me. Okay. okay. Oh my goodness. Alright, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching no. this episode of of bookcraft until next time Paige and Molly love you go rescue a book wait <laughs> <laughs>